You wrote, the more the universe seems comprehensible, the more it also seems pointless. Yeah. Can you elaborate a little on that? Uh, well, that's not the last sentence in the book. Uh, if you look at the book, then I, there's another paragraph that follows that, um, that explains uh, what I meant. Although perhaps I didn't explain it very well. I meant, what I meant in that, that statement is that there is no point to be discovered in, in nature itself. Nature, there is no cosmic plan for us. We are not actors in a drama uh, that has been written for, with us playing the starring role. There, is, there are laws, we are discovering those laws, but they are impersonal, they're cold. Uh, we are the result of billions of years of accidents that have led to us uh, governed by laws of nature that have no care for us. I, but then, after saying that, I went on and say, said that if there is no point in, in nature, we can make a point for ourselves. We can find things to cherish that we value. We can love each other. We can create things that are beautiful. And also, one of the things that some of us find to give point to our lives is to learn about nature. Um, it, it's not an entirely happy view of human life. I think it's a, a tragic view, but that's not new to physicists. Um, a, a tragic view of life has been expressed by so many poets that we are here without purpose, trying to identify something to care about. Uh, even when we find the final laws of nature, we won't know that why those are the correct laws of nature. Uh, but although, for example, Shakespeare very often expresses a tragic view uh, of life, uh, golden girl, lads and girls all must, like chimney sweepers, come to dust, uh, our tragedy is a little different from his from the heroes of Shakespeare's plays. Uh, for Lear and Othello, the tragedy is in Shakespeare's script. And what I like to say uh, is that our tragedy is that there is no script. Well, we don't know it. Well, we don't know it, and I could be wrong about this, of course. Uh, I'm not certain about anything. But the more and more we understand about nature, we find no sign of a script written for us, and we have to write the script ourselves. We're, if we're in the position of actors in a tragic drama, it's a drama we're improvising as we go along.